In the last two hours, we got our hands on the latest drought conditions across the state here. Uh, ABC 17's Kennedy Miller joins us live in studio this morning with a look into how the state is dealing with this issue. Kennedy. Good morning, Nate. According to the most recent drought report published this morning, over 91% of the state has abnormally dry drought conditions. That's up almost 5% when comparing data from last week. So far this month, our ABC 17 storm track weather team reported mid-Missouri, only seeing 1.5 inches of rain. Only a few areas in the state picked received higher amounts of rainfall. But recent rainfall still doesn't seem to be enough as most of mid-Missouri is still falling behind on seasonal rainfall. Now, if you take a look at the screen, I have last week's U.S. drought monitor right next to the latest drought monitor. The yellow area uh, indicates abnormally dry drought conditions. And we have this orange area that indicates severe drought conditions. And in the red here, that's extreme drought conditions. Anything you see here on this map that isn't colored, those areas aren't receiving any drought issues right now. And then in recent severe drought across the state pushed Governor Parson to issue a drought alert for 60 counties. In an effort to help farmers impacted by the drought, Governor Parson announced a plan on Tuesday. That plan would provide farmers with emergency hay and water as drought conditions continue. Uh, Nate, I do have a question for you. Now that we have a more recent drought update for the state, how would you say numbers differentiate when comparing the drought report three months ago? You know, as we 